think, you know, uh, if if Ben Askren can really hang with Jordan Burrow still, dude, I yeah, insane. Because everybody who rolls with him, I've never, uh, I never even clinched with him, but. Everybody who's done everything with him, like I'll, the closest I came to a clinch is like that hug you do when you bro yeah. hug a dude <laughs> for a little bit just to feel it out. But they say that it's like he's got four arms. They say, dude, it's ridiculous. Oh, I've heard Gene Thomas about was him. telling me. Gene yeah. Thomas was saying, dude, it's ridiculous. I've, I've it's heard like it doesn't even make sense. Molly Wops, world champions, we all know. Yeah, just ragdolls people. That's how good his wrestling is. I mean, if you see that fight with Robbie Lawler, the fucking bombs that guy took. <laughs> it's fucked up. And the early, fact that man. he still figured out a way to get a hold of Robbie Lawler's neck. They still figured out a way to get him into that headlock once, and Robbie knew he wanted to clinch with him. He couldn't keep him off. Dude, I was sweating in that fight. You and I hyped Woo! him up so much. I was like, "Oh, please don't get starched in the first round." <clears throat> it's still a super controversial ending to me. Well, what you had Herb on? What did he say? Well, Herb said that. First of all, Herb Dean is the shit. Nice guy. Couldn't be nicer. Great guy. But it, I love his perspective. So laid back, and he, his ego is so healthy. Like the way he talks about things, like you, you don't see any. It, it, it's very reasoned, it's like, like the way he approaches things. But he's just like chilled out, and he's like very self-deprecating and chilled out about it. But he had a very good point. He was like, "That's not just a manipulation of the neck, like in terms of like cutting off the carotid artery. He's like, this is a manipulation of the spine. It's like a, a bit of a neck crank." And he was thinking about that. He was talking about like you look how he's got a hold of the head and how it's he goes. The real what I'm concerned with is if someone's going unconscious from from some nerve shit. Oh wow! Yeah, like from a neck crank. Like apparently he had seen a guy who had got neck crank like that, and then afterwards the guy couldn't walk. He like couldn't move. It came back, but for Still. moments. But for moments he couldn't move. See, this is shit we don't even think about. I'm like exactly. Dude. Yeah, exactly. That's Herb's, why he's Herb Dean. He's the gold standard. He's the gold standard. It's Big John McCarthy and him, and Big John doesn't do it anymore. So it's Herb. So it's Herb Dean. Bro, you know. And um. Just that, when you think about it, and Askren says, what he says is that, you see, that's nasty, dude. That looks terrible. That's nasty. With the way he's holding on to the head like that and, and cranking your neck. I like that they're not It's a very bad position. I like that the UFC went, oh, all right, we're good. Yeah. I, I dig that. I, I get it. I want to see it again. I, 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 I disagree. <clears throat> I think that um, I, I agree with Herb Stoppage, and uh, I, I see the that the arm went limp. But then the thumb came up. But then as soon as he let go, Robbie jumped up. Usman had me convinced that Robbie was never out. But Herb had me convinced that it was too dangerous for him to, to allow it to going. continue once the arm dropped in that weird way. So do you side with Herb? You have to side with Herb. Yeah. In that situation. He's the expert. You have to side with Herb. Because he's right. Because that is a special circumstance. See, I looked at it in terms of, and I didn't even consider this when I was talking to Usman, that I looked at it in terms of, it's just a choke. Yeah. And Herb like, no, it's a neck crank. Me too. So... Uh, but still, I'd love to see it again. 